do you know that with the right amount of calcium in your snail feed you can easily get your snails to grow from this into this yeah you spot the difference right funny enough the big snail is still growing and also with the right amount of calcium a badly injured snail will recover in no time in this video i'll be telling us about the benefits and the application of snail shell and most importantly i'll be showing us how to process the snail shell into calcium source that can be fed to your snail to get better results so before i go further please remember to hit the like button and subscribe to the channel to enjoy more useful content i'll be uploading in the future and to be notified as soon as i upload such videos so let's go the snail shell is made up of about 98% calcium carbonate which is a compound that is very rich in calcium so this makes the snail shell a natural source of calcium for livestock feed production you can get the snail shell in large quantity by contacting the snail processor or by going to a nearby market where they process and sell snail the snail shell there is very cheap no matter where you get the snail shell from, they come in dirty, so don't worry about the dirt on the snail shell. The first thing to do is to crush the snail shell slightly and this can be done by the use of a mortar and pestle and you can also crush it by pouring it into a sack and eating it with a stick, both will give you same results. The next thing to do is to pour the crushed shells inside the clean water and you stir continuously you notice the water change color instantly this is as a result of the deaths on the shells pack the shells out of the water by using this kind of device and if you don't have you can easily strain the water then you rinse the snail shell again while we rinse the snail shell for the second time another fact about snail shell is that it is used in water treatment as it absorbs heavy metals from water bodies and also snail shell can be used to reduce soil acidity relieve heartburn and relieve stomach upset after the second drains you can remove the snail shell but if you feel the water is dirty and the snail shell is still dirty you can rinse the third time so having done this you remove the snail shell and allow water drip off spread out on a flat surface for it to dry off for 30 days or you can use an oven to dry it off for hours i prefer using galvanized um, roofing sheet cause that absorbs it more and allows it to dry up in no time i've got an old lady in the market who collect crush rinse and sun dry the snail shell for me so i collect and process the next phase is to grind the snail shell to increase the surface area and this can be done by the use of normal grinding machine in the market or you can use the hammer mill if you have one or if you have a feed mill you can use the particles is still not fine enough after the first round of grinding so you sieve before grinding for the second time this ensures a final product of fine consistency all through et voilà this is what you get after you grinded it uh, this contains 98 percent calcium carbonate and you can bag this and sell to other farmers to use to formulate their feed and at certain percentage this can be included in your feed formula to ensure that you get a better result than the one you are getting presently as a snail farmer or as a livestock farmer in general remember to hit the like button and subscribe Till next time, a peace.